Hello YouTube and my friend, welcome to my channel TMGTCG. So uh, today I'm going to give a simple guide to Kaladesh pre-release that is on September 24th and 25th this weekend. First of all, enjoy your pre-release and good luck. So um, in Kaladesh pre-release pack, you have six poster pack, a spin down live counter, a constructible trooper which i hope is, is a premium token trooper uh, token rather than uh, this constructible paper trooper right just like eldritch moon we got a premium foil zombie token which is good so the format is going to be a minimum 40 card seal deck constructed from six booster back in the previous pack as well as your uh, premium foil date standard promo card so in Kaladesh there are three new mechanics the first one is Riga this is a new artifact card it has power and toughness as well but it is not a creature it has a, a, a crew ab a ability that turns in turns it into a artifact creature so in order to activate its crew ab ability you need to tap any number of creature you control with total power equal to or greater than the crew number this include the one that just entered the battlefield or you also can tap an animated vehicle to crew another vehicle which sound a bit ridiculous but hey this is the this is the rule for this new mechanic crew the second one is energy this is represented by energy counter it's a new kind of counter that player can get through certain cards and it can span for some things for example um Wheeler virtual soul uh, it require um it when it's under the battlefield you get three energy counter and if you pay the three energy counter it create a one one colors troopers the last new mechanic is called Fabricate. Certain creature enter the battlefield with an option of either put a number of plus one plus one counter on the creature or create a number of one one colorless servo artifact creature tokens. The number after the fabric tell you how many plus one plus one counter or servos you get. But please note that your opponent has a choice to respond. Thus, if the creature with fabricate isn't on the battlefield after the stack is resolved, you uh, you choose to create a server token. That makes sense, right? All right. So lastly, there is a rebrand mechanic called create. This is basically uh, put uh, put X or Y Y Y uh, power why toughness why colors trooper artifact creature token you fly onto the battlefield right so um this is a huge set so um and then usually we we'll get more uh you know in the pack you have like eight common or nine common three uncommons right so usually i will look at those uh, notable uncommon and common that i would consider of putting into my 40 card sales that for white you have knife bridge retro one white so whenever any creature you control leave the battlefield build a plus one plus one counter on uh, knife bridge retro a one one this include token so this is kind of is uh, is very good clear shift ace one one white yeah first strike so uh, when it's crew of vehicle that we vehicle gain for strength until end of turn so quite good if you build your deck around vehicle artifact uh, card uh, so this is a uh, eddy trail hawk flying two drop for one two trusty companion two drop for three two vigilant but it can attack a lot so if you build around token tag this card can easily get um, get around its limitation uh, 
real responder is very good as well so uh, one one generate two white fire energy life link to three very good in limited tesla dome dairy one drop zero four very good for blocker fairground warden two one white one three when it sends the battlefield, exile a target creature and opponent control until it leaves the battlefield. Very good in the middle. So, Sky Veiler Shot, do one right, destroy a target creature with power 3 or greater, and you are, you are, you, you can Sky one. Build to last one drop, target creature get plus 2, plus 2 until end turn. If it is an artifact creature, it gain indestructible. Very good. So for black, um, Dayang is good. Choose a target creature, you get a two energy counter, and you can pay any amount of energy counter. That creature get minus one minus one until end of turn for each count any energy counter pay this way. It's a sorcery. It's good. Uh, some um, this operative one black. As long as you control artifact. This uh, it gets plus one plus zero and have that toughness. Uh, sorry, and had that touch. Two drop for two two. M usually you get three two, so it's a very good. In in the other born marauder, three one black fighting right lane. When it enters the battlefield, you can move any counter from other permanent you control onto other born marauder two two. So this card can really get very big, especially you build your seal deck around fabricate mechanics. Diabolic Tutor, two, two black, search your library for a card and put that into your hand. So this card will, will, allow, uh, will help you to get in, get out of a very tough, <coughs> excuse me, very tough situation as when you need a let's say a uh, uh, sorcery or instant death to kill your opponent creature ascend extraction one two black deal three damage to a target creature and you gain three life in instance right so very nice <coughs> excuse me night market lock look out one black when you end when you tap each opponent loses one night and you gain one night one one this that this card is very good in a uh, in a artifact with crew ability seal that uh, weapon craft and to reserve two black zero one so basically because this is fabric two you have uh instantly it will push push up to uh two three tight conclusion destroy target creature you gain one life for each artifact you control five drop so uh, this card will help you to get get out of tough situation rush for val uh, vitality to drop target creature get plus one plus zero and gain life link and indestructible and you and turn very good in uh, good for back um, very good combat tricks for red um, incendiary Sabotage 2 to red instance sacrifice an artifact deal 3 damage to each creature. So basically it, it may help you to wipe the whole board. Right? Harness lightning 1 1 1 red instant choose target creature you get 3 energy counter pay any amount of energy counter deal that time much damage to that creature. Very nice. Building spark to red instant it deal x damage to the target creature where x is the three plus the number of artifact you control so um, you can build uh, artifact red deck right I like this card uh, bronzen scorch so it's basically uh, two to red 
and then it's haze three three. Chandra Viral Hel- Helix one one rate instant due to damage the as uh, due to damage divided as you choose among one or two target creature and or player. Speedway Fanatics one one rate this card this card is, is a must in a regal deck so uh, you cast your you cast your vigor tap this card then um, then that vigor gain haste until it turns Malfis dog buster for drop for 4 2 basically this will help you to uh, generate two energy counter and you can use that energy counter to uh, to stop target creature from from blocking your attack separating grimlings uh, basically uh, when an artifact come into uh, into your battlefield you get it gets plus two plus zero and gain trample and until you enter very good in limited Build to smash, um, uh, instant one drop target attacking creature get plus three plus three until ten. If this is an artifact creature, it can trump trump up. So when I start your engine, so these cards is uh, is a must in a regular deck. So basically, all your regular view re- become artifact creatures until you end a turn and it gets plus zero oh sorry plus two and plus zero until you end a turn so this will uh, you know will if your opponent is not able to uh, to block this may be game over for your opponent spark of creativity one drop choose target creature excel the top cards of your library you may have It deal damage to that creature equal to the Excel card which converted mana cost. If you don't, you may pay the you may play that card until end of turn. So this is uh, very good in limit. Uh, I don't think this I don't think this will help much in limit, but in construct constructive constructed deck, it will be helpful. Like three Amoko promise and. Right, so who can? I think I think no creature can uh, can can uh, can uh, stop the stop the attack. I mean, can withstand that that damage, right? For blue, uh, gear seeker, sp- uh, sp- ser- serpent, sorry, uh, seven drop for five six. It costs one less to cast for each artifact you control. So, artifact slash uh, slash pool, then you this card will be a lot cheaper. And then when when the gun blade master, I like this card. Two drop, two three. It has powers. Ceremonious rejection, one drop counter tar- target colorless spell. Very good in unlimited constructed. Gen Jack Sentry to blue. When it enters the battlefield, you get to uh, energy counter. And you you can tap this card. Play uh, pay two energy counter. You may tap or untap target artifact or creature. Dramatic reversal. One 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 generate one blue. Untap. All non-land permanent you control, very good. So uh, you attack ready, cast this one, then you can use your non-land permanent to uh, to to block. So as you can see, uh, Ajani is in this card here. So maybe he will be in the next set called other reward. I think Ministry of In Inquiries, one drop. For one two, very cheap, and again this um this uh this allow you to get two energy counter, and it has sort of like a mill uh ability, tap pay an energy counter, put 
the top three cards of his or her library in his or her graveyard. I think in limited you only have 40 cards, so this may create an uh, issue for your opponent. Glean next cray one one blue one tree a flying creature. Uh, so allow you to look at the top four cards of your library and you can put an artifact card into your hand. Wing Dragger Two to blue, two to flying, nothing much to say, generate for green. Nature way. Um so this is a sorcery, one one green. Target creature you can no gain, vigilant and travel and turn. And it deal damage equal to its power to the target creature you don't control. Very, very strong. It sorcery card. Prima Outrider. Two to green tromble for 3-3, three, three, fabric, so it's 4-4. Four, four. Quite good. In terms of mana cost, larger than life, 1-1 one, one green. Target creature gain, plus 4, plus 4, and gain tremble until end of turn. Servant of the, of the Conjure, 1-1 one, one green. Creature, when you enter the battlefield, you get any 2 energy counter, and this allows you to do um, your mana fixing in case. So uh, quite good in limited to do. Commencing, uh, sorry, commandments of festivities. One 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 blow prevent all the combat damage. Good for our defense. Elbow back stomper three two green five four tramper and when it enters the battlefield you gain five life. Very good in limited. Blossoming defense, one drop, target creature you control gain plus two plus two and gain. This is instant and gain hex proof, hex proof until end turn. Very nice. Uh, this uh, Riparian Tiger, three to green, creature cat, tremble. Again, uh, energy counter generation, generator, and you can pay two energy counter. And you get plus two plus two and then you turn four four. Very big, you can get very big. So a deal with either one drop so search your library for basic land, put it in your hand, and you get two energy counter. Again it's energy counter generator. So uh yeah. So wow wanderlers allow you to search for, for a land and put into the battlefield 4 drop for 3 2 reasonable fairground trumpeter 3 drop for 2 2 so uh, so basically um, this go well with uh, fabricate deck because whenever there is a 1 1 counter being placed on a permanent you put a plus one plus one counter on this monster as well so quite good could we more two two green destroy targets artifact or enhancement or lands take down one drop uh, choose one take deal four damage to the target creature with flying or deal one damage to each creature with flying so for multi now it's a multicolor, common or uncommon. As a uh, viewer, virtual, as I uh, as I mentioned before, it allows you to create one one color troopers, counterband, kimping, blue, black, where a live link one four good for defense. So whenever an artifact enter your battlefield, sky one, embryo voyager, one one green one blue. 2-3 flying trumpers so whenever this deal damage to a player you get that many energy counter so very good in the energy count counter that veteran motorist uh, red white 3-1 sky 2 when you enter the battlefield when it screw a vehicle that vehicle get plus one plus one until end turn so very good in the vehicle type. 
Voltrade Brower Green Red Tridu Again, this allows you to generate uh, two energy counter. So when you when it attack, you may pay one energy counter. It get plus one plus one and gain trample until enter. Very powerful cards. It can get very big. Unlicensed disintegration one black and red destroy target creature. And if you control artifact, deal three damage to that creature controller. Right. So these are the multicolor common and common. I will consider to put in my seal deck. Now it's artifact. No. Bomet, Bangs, Baza, Bach, Four, Rager. When the enter battle fell, draw card. Cool three five five. Iron Lister. Four haste favorite one two two artifact creature. We generate freighters three crew two for two four four three. So this this is the card that I will consider um, building in my regal deck because the crew only uh, need two. So and yet uh, you get a four three and when it's attack actually it become five four and gain and has trample so this is i will look out for this uh, this common card crow worker pass not two drop and uh, one white create a one one colorless uh, artifact creature token when it enter battlefield also create a one one colors silver artifact creature chief of the foundry a reprint definitely good to boost up your artifact creature Sky skip, crew one, two for two three flying. Uh, this is another vehicle um, uh, artifact I will put into my um, deck. Wood uh, waver pass not. When you turn the battle, you gain three and get three energy counter. So this allow you to gain some life, right? Eagle construct. Uh, two for two two is an artifact creature. Each player may sky one. Sneer Tropper for flying haze for three two. I will put into my deck. Bash Shon Mastodon five four five a huge monster and again vigilant for one white. Oh well, choice Dresser for. Trumper Haste 6 1 Crew 1 Even better this one Ballester Charger Charger 5 Crew 3 6 6 So it do 1 damage to the target creature or player when it attack Figi Familiar 3 2 2 When it's in the battlefield you gain 2, two life when it dies draw a card Foundry Inspector 3 Artifact spell you cast cost one less to cast three two. So and um and so those are the common and uncommon uh card that I will consider to put into my uh forty card sale deck. And looking at the all the creature, I'm thinking of building a vehicle deck that is uh uh white 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 and red combination right so so these are this is the uh, pre-list deck that i'm thinking about if i able to open some of the good vehicle uh, deck so lastly there's a lottery in each poster bag and you know they uh, so you may pull one of the 30 cash invention this is very similar to Seneca expectation in Battle for Seneca and Oath of the Gatewatch and now they all belong to the category Masterpiece series. So Kaladesh Invention is very gorgeous with metallic copper coloring and here are some of the examples. Hangerback Walker, Cloudstone Curio, Chrome, Chromo Mox, Soaring 
mana create mana work so uh, lastly i i wish you all again enjoy your pre-release and good luck in your in your uh, pre-release and uh, remember to go to your lower game store earlier so that you have more chance to analyze your your cards and build a decent deck outfit all right see you next time bye bye so i'm going to open some fat packs no it's no no more fat packs open abundant and a uh, poster box when there's an official when official release of college see you next time bye bye